So the auto drive on this car, um, as I've said, when it's uh, when we're sort of going um, and it's it's got warning, as in, i.e., it sees the signs. It, it does slow you down, admittedly, after you've gone past the gate for it, so like the mile an hour gate, um, and it does brake rather uh, abruptly. Um, if a car pulls out in front of you, but I'm just going to um, I'm just going to leave the camera going for a little while to see how we do at other speed limit signs, how it corners. So at the moment the car is is in auto drive. It's it's uh, every time you hear that bing, it's coming out of auto drive because it's something registering something so at the moment I'm I'm steering the car um, but it is keeping us at the right speed I think like the Tesla it needs to the whole road environment has to be right Way it would have been sort of guiding me round the, the uh, bend in the road, the corner. Um, I'm actually doing the steering bit now. Um, it's not geared up for our windy roads. No, it's not. It's not. I think Tesla have definitely got the. Um, the you know, they've definitely they're holding the trump cards when it comes to. Uh, automation uh, or, you know, the just is just better it is just better but um, well, you are only saying that because you watch stuff it's hearsay you've never actually yeah I've never actually did so did, this is it driven. I've never actually driven a Tesla so, so I I don't know you're following I'm, somebody else's opinion I'm following multiple people's opinions and, there, and what I do like is there are, you know, even Tesla owners will be the first to say that since it's come out of beta and it's now, um, is it assisted or supervised, supervised um, um, you know, self-drive, um, there is a lot of improvements. Yeah. You know, there are corners. There, I think there's a guy that's in this neck of the woods whose name has completely escaped me. Um, he, you know, he said that there are corners that his car would not go around, but now will. It slows down sufficiently to. And it won't. It won't be long before the Chinese, Japanese, Asian markets. Yeah, but even he'll catch up with technology and and go beyond. Well, Elon Musk has said that. Elon Musk has said that he's he, he sees his competition coming from the Chinese. Um, so we're back on auto drive. It is it is taking me around this corner. But you can't you can't make statements unless you have driven no, each it, of these cars and you're right you're right this is the first car that I have ever driven with <laughs> assisted driving um, so but I am I am very impressed so it's just counseled off which is a shame because I wanted to see if it would take me around this corner So drives back in again. It's because we're on a straight bit. Yeah. But it has been, as I say, it's there are corners it will go around and others it just seems to, unless it's because I'm so close to this lorry, we'll just back off a bit. Very nice house on the right. So 
is it is pulling me around this corner. I'm not doing anything. We're obviously slowing because of the slowing traffic. someone will tell me if um, if it goes wrong can you just turn it off and drive the car without any of the assistant, assistance that it gives I don't know look at all these closed pubs that's a closed pub what a shame so we're still in a 30 the car is still quite happily bimbling along at 30 probably much to the disgust of everyone behind me but I'm letting the auto drive system do what it needs to do. Now, is it going to pick up the 40? Yes, it has. And up we go. So we're 2.8 miles away from Clark's Village. As you saw there, it was another closed pub. It yeah. was actually 
where if it could pick it up to be down for 30 at the gate, so i.e. the start of the 30 mile now, which is what we should do, that would be absolutely brilliant. But it, it doesn't do that, which is a, which is a shame. Why don't councils and housing associations buy up these old pubs and turn them into apartments? Oh, and be sat empty because, and there's a housing crisis here well because if you did that in somewhere like this area I should imagine they would be rented out at astronomical prices no, the council or housing oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah. then you'd have affordable housing for people that live here yeah yeah valid point rather than it be sat there decaying and falling into disrepair yeah So we've passed two, which could at the very least make six to eight apartments dwellings. Yeah. Six to eight families that aren't on the housing list. Yeah, but this is logical, isn't it? And it, I guess, I mean, if you look at it, a lot of councils have sold off their... Um... No, but there's a lot of empty properties, a lot of empty buildings. Oh look, truck. Oh look, and they've stopped opposite each other. How amazing. And the white car carried on yeah. oblivious. What, pit? Bristol. Oh, they're on their way into hospital. Yeah, they're on their way to a job. Yeah, it's on the road. Yeah, she's on her way, sorry, I want to say to a job. I mean, they're on their way to... The hospital. To hospital. Which is what I said. Yes, you did. So 1.2 miles to go. Lady L was that lady's registration number on that Land Rover Discovery. Volt rapid charging here. We don't need a charge because we've got 63% battery left. On our right is Clark's Village, the Clark's Distribution Centre. So um, I believe that's where the new Clark's. Why did you speed up then? I didn't, the car did. Why did the car speed up? Because then? it saw a clear road in front of us. So that's why I took over and put my foot on the brake. So. Right, we're looking for the turning into Clark's Village. So I guess with the Tesla, the Tesla with the full package would have actually slowed down for the roundabout, would have seen that car and would have stopped. Um, the technology in this isn't as advanced, so it didn't. So I took over. Town centre parking, Clark's Village, carry on. Probably find it's cheaper to park in there. <laughs> you shouldn't really charge you to park in Clark's Village if you're flipping. You're spending shopping. money there, yeah, that's true. Space is just there. And oh. 
We are arriving. <laughs> we have arrived. Welcome to Clark's Village. 